Next, you need to check for the shear resistance of the plate gross area. This can be referred from this slide as given by the equation here and represented by the diagram here. The plate now is welded to the beam's web. Under the load, the beam's web may bring along part of the plate here, giving you the shear planes as indicated in the red color here. The shear resistance given by the shear planes are given in the formula here. The AV here represents the height of the welded plate times the thickness of the welded plate divided by a factor of 1.27. This height is obtained as 240. The thickness is 10 mm. The FY here is the grade of the steel which is 275. And the factor of safety here is equals to 1.0. Substitute the relevant value into the formula. You obtain AV equals to 1889.76 mn square. And substitute AV into the formula here. You get your shear resistance equals to 300 kN. The 300 kN refers to one shear plane as indicated by AV of HP times the thickness of the plate. The calculated value of 300 is to be multiplied to for two shear plane as indicated here, which give you 600 kN. Then, you will need to check for the shear resistance of the plate net area. This is again refers to this slide based on the formula here as represented by the diagram here. We are talking about the shear plane passing through the bolts hole and there will be two shear plane here and from the equation here there will be AV net, which is obtained based on the formula here, as the thickness of the plate times the overall height of the plates minus the numbers of bolt holes. Your thickness is equals to 10 mm. The height of the plate is equals to 240. Based on the diagram here. There are four bolt holes in one shear plane that give you n equals to 4 and the diameter of the bolt hole is 22mm. You will need to use the FU of the plate which is equals to 430 as refers to the table 3.1 grade 275. The factor of safety here is equal to 1.25. Substitute the relevant value, you get the AV net. And substitute the relevant value of the AV net, you get 389.3 kN. The value there represents a shear plan. There are two shear plans. This 389.3 kN needs to be multiplied by two shear plane that give you 778.6 kN. And then lastly, you need to check for the shear resistance of the web. This is referring to this slide. The effective shear planes are indicated in the diagram here which is calculated by multiplying the thickness of the web times 0 0.9 times the effective height of the steel plate as given in the formula here. The FY is the grade of the steel 
0.275 and the factor of safety here is equals to 1.0 substitute the relevant value into the formula you obtain this and substitute the relevant value here you obtain this now your shear resistance of the beam web is 312.1 kN there is only one plane here therefore the value is not to be multiplied with any value 